Today's video is for our brothers and sisters who are struggling to meet up a financial deadline. For those who are not sure of where they will get money to provide food for their family. For those whose bills are due or for those who need their debts to be paid off supernaturally. So please watch this video to the end. I wouldn't want you to miss all that I'll be sharing in today's video. So let's begin. Hello amazing family, welcome and welcome back to my amazing space on the internet. It's your girl Evelyn Ambrose recording from Abuja in Nigeria. If you're new to this channel, thank you so much for stopping by and if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much. It means a lot to me and I really appreciate it. If you're new to this channel, then you may consider subscribing because here I try my best to encourage you in your walk with Christ. Kindly go ahead and click on the red subscribe button and also turn on the notification bell so you don't miss out on our next upload. God bless you as you do so. Kindly give this video a like now or at the end of this video if this video made sense to you. Today I'm so happy. I'm so happy because I believe that God is about to settle his children financially. God is about to give them their testimonies. They have been watching a lot of people testify. God is saying, you too will testify. You would receive your testimony to encourage someone else. Before I start this video, I want us to agree in faith that God will send urgent help to our financial situation today because he can do the impossible. The Gospel of Matthew chapter 18 verse 19 says this, I also tell you this, if two of you agree here on earth concerning anything you ask, my Father in heaven will do it for you. We are more than two watching this video. So we have to come together to agree in faith and God will do it for us. If you believe this, then please drop in the comments, God will do it for me. Amen. So let's begin. Look at what Psalm 118 verse 24 to 25 says. This is the day the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. Please, Lord, please save us. Please, Lord, please give us success. May the Lord bless his words in our hearts. Amen. This is the day that the Lord has made. This is the day you found this video. This is the day for you to prosper. This is the day for God to give you a breakthrough in your finances. Please join me in this prayer. Dear Heavenly Father, we come before you in the name of Jesus Christ. On behalf of my brothers and sisters who are in need of an urgent financial breakthrough due to a deadline that they need to quickly meet up with. Lord, you are the provider of all our needs and we trust in your abundance provision. Lord, my brothers and sisters need a miracle right now. We ask that you meet all their financial requests. We claim the promise of Philippians 4 verse 19 upon their lives right now. Father Lord, we thank you that you are moving now on their behalf. We speak God's blessings and favor upon their lives. We speak a release of financial breakthrough from heaven upon them. My Father, my God, any demonic force that is stopping your children from being blessed financially, we take absolute control over it now. Satan, we bind you in the name of Jesus. Take your hands off the finances of God's children. We thank you, Jesus. We give you glory. We give you praise. Father, I thank you because I know that you have heard our prayers. All this we ask through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Please pardon my lightning. So yes, the first scripture here is Matthew 11 verse 28. And this is what the Bible says. Then Jesus said, come to me, all of you who are weary and carry heavy burdens, and I would give you rest. That is the first scripture I want you to hold so close to your hearts. This scripture tells us that God is worried about things that worry us. He also cares about our worries and he doesn't want you to carry this burden alone. So he's calling on you to give him that burden. He would carry it for you. Come to him, all you who carry heavy burdens. Your rent is due. Your landlord is calling you. You are owing somebody money. Your phone is ringing and you're looking at the phone. What do you say? 
drop that burden for Jesus. Drop it for him and he would lighten your burden. You shouldn't be the one carrying that burden. Jesus is there for you. Trust him and he's going to do a miracle in your life. Jesus wants to help you out. So come to him and drop your worries. This next scripture I want to share with you is Joel 2 verse 19. And this is what the Bible says. The Lord will reply, Look, I am sending you green and new wine and olive oil, enough to satisfy your needs. You will no longer be an object of mockery among the surrounding nations. This is so comforting. You will no longer be an object of mockery around your peers because God is going to send you that help you need. Pour out your body to God. Tell God the exact money you are looking for. You are no longer going to be an object of mockery. By the time God starts blessing you, the people who have been talking about you at your back will no longer have anything to say because God will provide all your needs. Now look at what Isaiah 45 verse 2 and 3 says. This is what the Lord says. I will go before you, Cyrus, and level the mountains. I will smash down gates of bronze and cut through bars of iron. And I will give you treasures hidden in the darkness, secret riches. I will do this so you may know that I am the Lord, the God of Israel, the one who calls you by name. See, that problem you're going through, God knows it. God knows your name, so he knows your problems. And this is a confirmation that he is going to give you secret riches. The kind of riches that will leave people in surprise, in amusement. He's going to go before you to level that mountain. The scenario right now in my head is that you are owing somebody and the person is about to call you. But God is going to stop that call from coming in because he wants to provide for you. You would clear up your debts before the call comes in. In short, the call cannot come in. The only call that can come in is, oh, I have received your payments in Jesus' name. Speak supernatural death cancellation in Jesus' name. I've heard testimonies like that, and that is why I believe deep down that God can do it for you. He would go before you to level the mountain, He is going to give you hidden treasures so that you would know that He is the Lord your God, the one who calls you by your name. Don't give up, it is not over yet. It is not over yet. Just in case you're new to my channel, I have a praying group. I'll be dropping the link to the WhatsApp group in the description. Feel free to join us for prayers. Praise God, somebody. God is good. Your rent is due. That's not a problem for God. It is not in your place to even ask, how is this miracle going to happen? No. Leave that one for Jesus. He knows how and who to use. Three powerful scriptures. Don't joke with them. Don't joke with them. The first one, release your burdens to God. The second one, you will no longer be an object of mockery. And the third one, he is going to give you secret riches. Receive all this and pray with it. Pray with it. Go on a fast. I've come to realize that fasting has a way of touching God because you are sacrificing something you love so much. Fast if you have to. And watch God do his wonders. These scriptures are so powerful that they can bring you instant financial solution. Remind God that you don't have anything or anyone. He is your everything. Remind God that you have run out of options. So you're calling on him right now to send your help. There is no room for doubts here. Your faith is all that is required. These are all God's promises. So stand with it. And declare it over your life. Pray with them. And soon you will start seeing things unfolding. God will use people from nowhere to favor you. He would give you wisdom to handle that business so you don't run in a loss anymore. God will save you from all your debts. No matter how much, no matter how many people, he's going to save you. You will come out of it victoriously. Like I said, don't bother yourself about how this is going to happen. All you have to do is ask Believe 
and receive it. I want you to get ready for your testimonies because we are going to celebrate on this channel by the grace of God. Amen. I trust that my God knows what to do for you and he will never fail. So that'll be all for now. Thank you amazing people for watching this video today. I hope this video made sense to you. Do like, follow, share, comment and subscribe to this channel if you haven't already because here I try my best to encourage you in your walk with Christ. That'll be all amazing people. I can't wait to see you on my next video and until next time this is Evening Ambrose saying bye.